say hi to the one second a day. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So as you can see from the title, today I'm going to be doing my impressions on skincare by Hiram's recommended products. Let's go. So right now there is nothing on my face. The only thing I did to my face was I curled my lashes and that is literally it. I had a history of okay-ish skin. Like my skin would go from really clear to texture to... So a lot of acne, not like a lot, but like I've, I've had some pimples, a bunch of pimples on my face at a point. And you can even go watch my older videos and you can see that my skin suffered from a lot of post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation. So I turned to Skincare by Hiram and then I tried most of his recommendations. The first product is the kale and green tea spinach vitamins superfood cleanser by used to the people and this is one of his top cleansers that he recommends to pretty much everyone unfortunately i couldn't get the big bottle of it but i was able to get the skincare kit their little travel size skincare kit and uh in it was the little cleanser so here it is <laughs> i've only used this a few times and i can say that this is not like other cleansers like this will not strip your skin and like make it feel as if your skin is so dry and you need to drench it in like toner and serums and essences obviously i have nowhere near as much knowledge as Hiram does or any other skincare specialist or dermatologist or esthetician so take it with a grain of salt but yeah this is one of the cleansers that he highly recommends to basically everyone and obviously it's good because it's sold out everywhere like the full bottles sold out everywhere I literally looked on Sephora and Amazon and even the youth to the people website and it's sold out so like there's one full-size bottle that is being sold for like $70 and I'm like y'all really trying to get that bank the other cleanser that he recommends to people with oily and combination skin is the inky list salicylic acid cleanser which helps reduce blackheads and breakouts so if i had to compare this cleanser with the one that i just showed you i would say that the consistency of this one is a lot more thick honestly when i first tried it it didn't really do that much in fact it actually made me break out even more i would say that this is a little over treating in my case but I feel like once my skin gets used to it, I'll be able to adapt to it. The next product is the Polish Choice 2% BHA Liquid Exfoliant. And let me just say that ever since I've been watching Skincare by Hiram, I've gotten so many ads about Polish Choice talking about, oh, I went foundation free for the first time. But I'm not complaining though because what they were promoting was this 2% BHA liquid exfoliant and I can say that I love this this is probably like my favorite product right now this is basically a liquid exfoliant that you can leave on your face and you're supposed to apply it every day twice a day this is supposed to you know make your pores look smaller because they can't physically be smaller it's supposed to unclog your pores and also smoothen your skin i put it on every day you guys just need to get this okay um i just want to say that i got the travel size mini version because i didn't know if i was gonna like it or not and since now that i'm obsessed with it i have to buy the full size one and by the way, I will link everything that I'm talking about in the description box below. Okay, so the next product is the Ordinary 100% Organic Cold Pressed Rose Hip Seed Oil. So basically, I actually saw this on TikTok and Hiram wasn't 
hating on it so I guess it's a go so essentially this oil is supposed to help even out your skin tone and just combat the post-inflammatory hyperpigmentation if I had to be honest I feel like I'm just overdoing it with the oil considering that I also have oily to combination skin um, because every time I use this oil even though it does help in a way I just find like a new pimple somewhere you know and I feel like it's because I'm just over treating my skin at the moment I feel like I'm just doing way too much that I'm supposed to um, the product itself are really good okay I mean there's a reason why Hiram recommends it right but it's just in my case I feel like I'm just overdoing it which is why I'm kind of going on a skin fast right now and honestly I've seen a lot of improvements since I just over treated my skin um, I'll actually insert some pictures over here of when I used to over treat my skin and compared to right now as you can see natural daylight like nothing on my face so yeah I just wanted to put that out there as a little disclaimer um, also I unintentionally did some oil plugging with this oil um, I don't know if you guys have heard of it if you guys have seen it on TikTok or heard it from the Golden Prescription or the Golden RX. Um, that's where she introduced uh, oil plugging, but also in Hiram's case and also mine, whenever I did oil plugging, I would get irritations on my skin and it would be red and itchy. So I don't recommend it to everyone. So be careful with that. And the last product that I'm gonna be talking about today is the infamous Ordinary AHA 30% and BHA 2% peeling solution. I feel like this product is just well known, especially in the TikTok community because everyone was talking about it at one point and I feel like they just had to get it. Even Hiram was talking about it and he was saying how this mask is actually pretty good. It might be a little intense if you do it a lot. So a lot of people recommend that you do it once a week and then twice and just kind of build up your immunity to it i guess and definitely do not leave it on more than 10 minutes because then it's going to cause irritation on your skin so there's that so i just want to give you guys a little piece of advice um before you use any skincare any new products that you want to add to your skincare regimen whether it's morning or night do a little patch test on your hand um, just to see if you know you're allergic to any of the ingredients if it causes you any irritations because I feel like it's just better if it happens on your hand and your face you know because everyone sees your face you know what I mean okay yeah so that was all of the products that I want to talk about in this video um, all of them was given the green flag by skincare by Hiram so I'm sure that you know it's good <laughs> but yeah if you want to see more videos like this let me know um but other than that please like this video so that i can get this video out to other people as well you know help boost my video um also comment and subscribe and please do not forget to click the bell button so you guys will be notified every time i upload which is a weekly thing so every week you get a new video from me okay and i'm so sorry for all the background noise um this is a new location and i'm facing a window so there's a lot of outdoor noises and it's also like 10 11 ish right now so everybody in my house is up like my dad is out there doing construction on our new patio and backyard space which by the way if you guys want a tour of the backyard once it's fully renovated then let me know um also if you want a updated skincare routine because you know obviously i have all those new products um you guys can also let me know but other than that i will see you guys next week bye process love process what you're saying love hyper big can you speak? <laughs>